Hey guys, it's Dr. Phil here. Welcome to the um, Deep Zoo in-depth tutorial on how to T-pose, as well as um, uh, some other stuff like how to spy crab, and why can't, and the uh, questions a lot of people are having still, and haven't been answered, why can't I chat in T2? Because I'm telling you, it is not a bug, it is an intended feature, and I will tell you what what to do, um, uh, what What's it, what does it mean? Why is this happening? And uh, how to um, fix it? It's not gonna be that easy to fix it. Like, <laughs> uh, all right, we're just gonna start out with how to T-pose. Now, it, here's gonna be a very simple tutorial. Right, for the scout, you're gonna need mad milk, and you're gonna need the death key bind. I'll talk to you about that in a later video, which I'm new today. Don't worry, it's not gonna be late gonna be actually right after this one. Alright. First thing you wanna do, your death bind, and then you're gonna wanna go back over to where you died. Jesus is slow even for a scout. And you're gonna wanna throw your mad milk. Now keep note. Hold down left trigger. Do not let go of it. Now press pick up. And now you are T posing. Just go into per person for this and see, T posing. Not quite T posing, it's more A posing, that's what people call it here. But yeah, your feet do the, your legs do this now. Ain't that neat? You kinda wobble all over the place. Alright, now next up is the pirate. So for this, you're gonna need, you can use any, you can T pose as any, with any, um, uh, all you need is your, uh, your, uh, freaking, uh, things that are right. I need is this, full ammo, capacity, and all you gotta do, die. It's the same thing for everything, I think. Um, you're gonna wanna use all of the upper ammo. I recommend using the uh, back burn for this. It is the best weapon you can use. Okay, and on t -posing. And yeah. And that's how you T-pose as the pyro. Next up will be some of these you cannot T-pose as. I know you can T-pose as the demo man. I don't know if you can T-pose as soldier or smatic or a spy. I think I'll uh, figure, I'll do some research on that. Now it's time for the heavy weapons deck. Alright, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna use your minigun, any kind of minigun, minigun works. You're gonna need to use your ammo as fast as you can because this is the only way to use all that ammo. Fast. No, no, this is the fastest way to use all your ammo. Once it goes down to zero, you do not stop, like, uh, do not stop from, um, uh, holding, uh, down the button to shoot and, uh, keep, keep it holstered. And you can T-pose. Like so. <laughs> I gotta give me flashbacks to a YouTuber who keeps on saying that. And um, for the NG, the NG, you need two people to do. And uh, yes, we have a NG down there. This is perfect. So what you need to do is that NG needs to place down a dispenser. And then uh, you can use anything. Uh, I'm using the Yurk effect to get down there fast enough because when you die, your items have a limited time to stay around. So what you're gonna need is this. You need them to place down dispenser. So let's ask them. Right, he's placing it down. Guess he needs to get some metal. Yeah! Alright, this is the perfect placement actually for this. So what you're gonna do is place down your exit teleporter. And um uh I'm gonna I should probably uh switch over to the jag real quickly or Yeah, this is gonna be hard. Um 
So what needs to happen is you need to die. Ain't that fast. And then, oh hey, Light Ranger, that's a pretty good gun. Light Ranger is a very good gun, guys. You should use it. So, I'm just gonna go back down there real quickly. Okay, spy. Do not sap that building. What is this man doing? His bombs don't bounce off the wall. Ugh, this is so annoying. There's a spy down here too. Probably back in here by now, though. This sucks. Oh crap! He left. Well, that ruins our English. Well, um. All right. You know what? I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna explain this to you. How to do this? All right. So what you need to do is you need a. Oh, hold on. Yes, he's back. Oh no, that's just a spy. Okay. And that, what happens is you need to have a dispenser. The best place you uh, need to have it is in a corner, for because for this glitch, what you're gonna need to do is you need to walk into your um uh, friend, friend's NG, um uh, dispenser. And then you're going to, once you're in it, you're going to have to have a uh, teleporter right next to it that you can walk back into. That's why I had that there. You're going to want to use the, um, uh, you can want to use the, uh, your gift after it because that's the fastest way to just do it. Or you could just have the normal teleporter. But yeah, so what happens is you need to die next to it with your, and your jet, whatever your wrench is out. And then you're gonna equip a different, different um, uh, wrench. It has to be different because this I can't pick this up. You need to be able to pick up the wrench. And when you, what happens is you need to have the wrench right here, and then you need to be inside that dispenser, like not totally inside, but it's gonna start pushing you out a little bit. And once you can, uh, once you uh, you have to have your mouse aimed on that. The, the uh, wrench, and once you can pick it up, you have to pick it up. Okay, you have to pick it up right away, and you have to be in that dispenser, slowly moving your way out. You, you can't be all the way out. It has to be like just then, right as you're slowly coming out, because it's gonna push you out as it exists. And then hopefully, if you keep on trying that, you will have the T posing engineer. And you will know because if you're on blue, your um, uh, skin actually changes to a red engineer. If you look at your um, uh, third person, your uh, everything you're holding will disappear as well. This will turn red. The uh, the blue part you can see of the person that'll disappear. And yeah. Speaking of that, I could also do a tutorial. Okay. Um. Uh, no. no. I have so many ideas. So the next one, you're gonna need Jurati as the sniper. And what you need to do, it's the same thing as Scout. Throw it, hold it down, and then pick it up. And that's how you do it. And we have the spy crap. I'll show you what it looks like. Ain't that epic, guys? That is pretty epic. Alright, now we're doing the spy and the spy crap. Right, go into third person. And that's how you do it. Pretty simple. So what's gonna happen is, as you walk around, it's the uh, 
Spy Crab's left arm will be lifted up and you'll look like a crab. That's why it's called the Spy Crab. Pretty funny, just keep on walking around. Yeah. Have some f have fun. Alright. Go try it out in the casual lobbies. Have a lot of fun. Like I said. Enjoy your time with you, because this is what DO2 is all about. It's all about having fun, doing stuff. Now. Um, uh. We're gonna talk about now why people can't talk in the chat. I'm gonna do another separate video on this, because I feel like not well, people won't be to the end of this video. And they, uh. They won't. They're not gonna click on it if it has, like, a how to T post tutorial site. No. But the reason why people can't chat is because in a recent uh, I may have dropped it, I can't pull it up because that's gonna close our screen recording, but I'll explain it to you. It recently a valve has started to step up against cheaters. And they've done this by basically um uh, you have to be paid to play now to in order to chat. If you don't have some sort of microtransaction, like buy, if you haven't bought a, any, you can buy any item by the way, that you, you can buy a really cheap one in the store that goes for like three cents, that's all you have to do. And yeah, that's how they fixed it, because now people have to pay and it fixes the bot problem. Yeah, right, let's get into more detail though. Oh hey, you can see the map right here. In the desk. But anyway, um, alright, uh, how to fix this, that is how you fix it. You need to, uh, um, in order to fix it, you need to pay. Now, I recommend buying something useful that can actually help you out. You don't have to use any, at that much money, you just have to put some money into your Steam account. I think the max you have to do is five to add it to your account. Five bucks, by the way. I got myself two keys um, of the Spooky Spoils chest because I really like the Halloween hats. I really wanted to get Chicken Keeve or Bird Keeve. Or I want to get the Medic Bird. Oh, that'd be so nice. And yeah. So, yes, this don't. Please don't have any under resource sanding. This is not a glitch. This is totally intended. Alright, now, let's uh, go even more into step. TF2 is actually, in case this is hacking to you still, you can actually, or uh, somebody's just spamming the mic. If you go over into advanced settings, they have added the communications options. Uh, enable voice chat and enable text chat. I have enable voice chat disabled. Because uh, it's spammers. Because now they've started to do spamming because they haven't made it so you. I think that's what they need to do. They need to make it so um, you have to be pay to play to do the voice yeah, chat. Yeah. That'll totally fix the problem. But I think that'll just really get on people's nerves for the pay to play players. Alright, so. Um. Next. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, maybe we could get some gameplay in now. Uh, why the heck not? People don't want to see me dying a lot, but, yeah. Now, um, this does, oh yeah, um, uh, something I recommend you also get. You should, you should probably, um, uh, do $10. Use $10. And, uh, with that, you can, uh, get yourself two keys. Maybe two crates if you're willing to not wait for the spooky spoils crates or whatever you're getting. Um, but then you can actually, um, uh, you can buy yourself a Jungkook Inferno contract. It only costs 250 I think. Don't bother with the MVM, because that only lasts once. And you, you could get some trash stuff. It won't be any good. I've been actually thinking about it a while, though. Australian stuff would be nice. Mm -mm. Um, so yeah, you're gonna need, uh, some pretty good teammates as well. I do not recommend sweating it, though. Do not be a sweat. Have fun. Uh, yeah, you could also, 
I I bought the Jungle Inferno contracts because it's right, it gives you a lot of value for such a little price. Because you can get yourself the Yeti set, you can get yourself a Sex and Heal hat. Normally that'd be. I mean, those are hats and uh, customization parts. You normally have to pay like a lot to be able to have those. Obviously. The problem with this is you need to do a lot of um, uh, progression and uh, campaign stuff, but I, I am willing to do that. If you are too, try it. That's what it's all about. And yeah, let's get straight into the memes though now. All right. Um, should I stop the video here and just do another one now? Um, I'm not sure. We'll move on to the next video. Alright, this is Dr. Phil signing out. Peace out, guys. Oh, that was nice.